<laughs> Yo, what's good? What's popping? It's your girl, Jessica Z. Uh, we are having a heated gauntlet tonight, and I'm loving it. Uh, we want to see blood. It is amazing. We have three battlers left in the hat. Um, we have Ritz, we have Devolino, and we have Entity. So it's an odd number. We are going to be bringing somebody back to battle whoever is left in the hat for the our semifinals. Um, we have three names. I'm going to choose a name. Oh my God, are you ready? We also have three judges. We have um, RD, uh, the, the GM of Bars Media. Uh, he's a wicked battler. I wish he was doing these things, but I'm glad he's here. We got Benny Bizzle, the old champion. Um, great judge, great battler, and Ty. Ty, you're amazing. The Chong or the Cheech to my Chong. All right, first name I'm pulling out. Is it suspenseful? <laughs> this Devolino. <laughs> All right, so it's either Dove against Ritz or Entity. Are we ready for this? Oh yeah, it's Entity. Yes. <clears throat> yes. So, Dev, you can unmute yourself. Everyone else, mute themselves. I'm gonna say yep. I want Dev to choose the coin flip. Because Dev was pulled out of the hat first, Ty Jones is going to flip the coin, and Dev call heads or tails. Okay, um, heads. It's tails. Hmm. Go ahead. You want me to go first? It's, it's cool. All right, it's going to be a minute on Dev whenever you're ready. Okay. See, see the night y'all got me against a guy that have been through it all. It's good. Well, if I chop off his legs, then he'll never stand tall. So I know this guy, he can actually rap, rap. And when he spit his bars, lyrics, yeah, he don't just be on that shit where he ready to just chat. Nah, his shit actually smack. His shit goes far. I ain't talking about the DVD. He do it all. Well, he going against me, so tonight I'm going to have to impress. I'm going to do it. Make sure I got on the right shit and I came there dressed and impressed. But it ain't even about that. But it is what I'm about to do. I'm going to do better than about that. XP know about that. Yeah, because he only rap when he ready to spit his bars. Well, Forget that. That man ain't go far. Well, they're here tonight. I'm ready to show that you'll never see the end of me. So either tonight, I'm going to have to do what I came to get from the gun, and we'll see if it's going to shoot till it's empty. No, I'm going to shoot till it gets to the end to T. Let's go to the T. That's dope. Uh, first round on Entity whenever you're ready. Yeah, I know you heard my name. And you knew this shit was up to raffle. Now you're going to use Titan's scheme and try and do a compliment battle? Come on. When I hear Devolino, all I think is them teeth with an S. Now I'm going to leave you deceased in the chest. This ain't no piece off the chest. I mean, every single time I hear you spitting about your mama, it's like Mr. Retarded MC Hammer coming out with no stamina, a couple holes in his pajamas. I couldn't say it's like you twice bitten. Once bitten, nah, I do this like a time bomb tick and adapt to detonate like a C4. Have you running a detour, talking using my name? It's like you getting it for your fame. It's like pleasure and pain. It's the mad had it down a hole like Alice in Wonderland. It's like, oh my God, hear that rah, rah, hear Divolino come again. I doing this like the watch turn backwards, no hands. Couldn't even understand or maybe comprehend that he has to have bucks to be the man. He's like Fat Albert. Hey, hey, hey. It's like payday Hi. for the snake and MC that says he wants to stay away. All right, round two. Uh, Devolino, whenever you're ready. Hmm. I heard you mention that Fat Albert. Well, he's just something that got mustard on his shirt. Well, see, if he actually set on you, that should actually hurt. You just 
an old Eminem in his old age. Well, see the night, Mr. Enter T, David, whatever you want to call yourself, your music is not going to get played. If you was at a job, the boss will say you never get a raise. Your music will never get played. If you was over here, bitch, I'll make you my slave. We could pull out the best cars and you'd never be an ace. So that means I got you eights. When you go against me, you got eight. Tonight, you could be the snake, but you better rattle. Mm, don't go run to somebody and tattle. Tonight is your wrath. I ain't on WCW, but you can get that. Yeah, I'm blowing out the wrath for the reef. Told these niggas, I've been the king. Most of them can't mess with me. Well, tonight, they could get my boot or my foot, my sneaks. Two, two, to the loo. That's what you get when you mess with a king. Sorry, you never make it through. Tonight, Hi. I'm the dentist, and I'm here to take out more than your two. Now I'm waving bye bye to your toodaloo. I'm about to kick you in the ass and knock you clear out your food of the looms. Have you more complex than a Rubik's cube? That means you're confused. Oh my God, here comes Entity. Watch me come through during an interview. Put your DD glasses on because this class is on. I'm like a mastodon that's about to blast on you like NASA. Prove you're an asshole with a cash full and maybe fistful. Couldn't even say that I'm Episcopalian. Move you to Nova Scotia like an oven roaster. It's like that Coconosha. It was nice to know you. Devilino, primo, brightest color on the scene, yo. I didn't even know that you was wanting to be a fiend, though. Call me Eminem, package you up like Entenmann's and send your entire family my motherfucking sentiments. I'm sorry I had to go a verse with cursing. Doing this like you was barely even binocular optical vision as I'm going over excursions. Go ahead, look at that up. I'll hand you a thesaurus on top of a dictionary. I'm painting pictures for indentured servants while you're saying you're using the what? You couldn't think of the word. It's like you passing it over, doing this like an over the shoulder roller coaster. Hi. I'm flipping it over. Uh, round, round three, Devolino. Round three, Devolino. You're muted. There we go. I'm here. I'm here. All okay. right. So look. So look. I heard you mention something about Nosha Costa. Well, that means tonight your rap shit is over. You just something but bread. If I have to, I'll put you in a toaster. I tired of told you, you'll never even have that sign, which means that you won't be on that caution shit. I don't pay attention to that. I keep driving on. You just something that gets the mood be moved on. Well, from your soul, I have drawn, and I'm your seeker, which means you had to meet your ether. I ain't talking about Nas, but tonight I'm on my fucking rise. That means I'm going to dot every T, make sure I dot every nine. No, dot every I. You can get my tech before the nine. This shit, working it for it all my life, it was a hard grind. Never was worried about being signed. Oh, I've been working at it like I was working out a half matic. No, you can get it. I ain't sleeping on the craft man. I told you I do this. You won't be shit after it. So, David, it's crazy. You better get on your spade, David. Spade. Well, tonight, David ain't have his spades. Hi. David better get a fucking raise. That's the end of that shit. No kid and play. I should see round three. All right. So I know you was spinning that shit hard like you was trying to put it on me, boy, but Devilino. Quit playing with your dicky, Tommy boy. You in the middle of the lake, I'll leave you face down. Transparent, doing this like you cold villain. That's right, you like a trans Karen. Always bitching, you like a Zod premises. I'm fighting an arch nemesis. Couldn't even see the archdiocese crying up in the churches. I'm trying to hurt you in the third round. It's like you're hurting, like I'm thirsting now. A wolverine, a full machine with an exoskeleton is so supreme. Like this cross around my neck that somebody said. It's like retrospective. I might as well meet you at the red eye. I do that like a dead guy that you are. I rip you apart into two parts. Watch you heavenly departed. 
I mean, the solely retarded, looking like Beetlejuice. I ain't even saying that I'm needing you. It's what I need to do when I'm cocking this pistol and hitting you with two eagles. Spit you like you're too spiritual. Couldn't say that I sear you like in the oven with a couple pipes down, lines down. Oh, my God. The time now has come for you to meet your devastation talk about this caucasian and put you in amazement with no hesitation while i'm releasing this information cocking now entity one Blah! time all right that was a fire battle um fuck yeah fuck yeah salute fellas all right rg you want to go you want to talk or you, hey, you, you know you always make me go first i'm good with I, that. it's usually I am betty happy with the responsibility i used to pick betty but i'll pick you tonight all right. All right. So um, round one, I got going to entity. I thought that uh, I'm mean, starting with Devolino. Um, you know, we started with the chop legs, never stand tall. He was scheming right off the top of this one, right? You know, he was talking a lot of shit, but um, I felt like through a, a, both, or I mean, all three rounds, there was a Devolino was talking a lot about himself. Um, and other than in this round, but he was the only time he'd really talked about entity in that first round, he was complimenting him. And then entity went around and flipped that in the opener of, of his round. Right. Um, the whole Titan scheme, compliment battle flip, uh, the teeth scheme, the Mr. Retarded MC hammer, uh, holes with holes in the pajamas. Uh, he had a lot of punches that hit for me. Uh, the biggest part of entities round one was his um, multi-syllabic rhyme scheming for me. Um, I love hearing three, four and five syllable plus, uh, rhyme structure. Uh, so entity does that a lot within his freestyles. And I really appreciate that. Um, oh, and plus entity was talking to dev. It was a lot more direct round one to entity round two. I also have to entity for kind of similar reasons. Um, Devolino started with that fat Albert flip and I fucking love that. Um, he went in with the old Eminem stuff. It was okay. Uh, the, this is what the, my favorite part of this round is like, you never get erased music, never get played, then turn into be my slave. Then something about aces and snakes. Like he had, he was tying all uh, when dev gets on a fucking a rhyme train, he fucking rides those rails. You know what I'm saying? And he got on one of those fucking flow and he was just going. So I like that. Um, the only thing again, though, he was talking a lot. They it's like, he was talking to the world. Like, I think dev maybe got so like a something on it on his mind today and he's just fucking spitting some shit to the world but it wasn't really to entity um whereas in round two entities uh opener was hilarious uh he had multis within his multi-syllabic rhyme structure which some people don't realize that those are two different things they are um and again with the four and five syllable uh rhyme structure uh he had the m m scheme from devs round that he flipped in a really good way uh and he flipped the slave scheme as well um, he paid attention to what Dev said, and he responded to a lot of it. Round two to Entity. And uh, round three, and I got to call it a gentleman's 3-0. Entity did a lot of the same stuff. He kept the foot on the gas. Um, if this was a drag race, it's like he knew exactly how far ahead of Dev he was, and he put as much gas on, or um, he put the fucking throttle down as much as he needed to to maintain that gap. Uh, Devolino started with the flip, which was good. He Devolino is great with rebuttals. Uh, he had the bread put you in the toaster scheme. He had that caution sign scheming that he was kind of doing there. I like that. The tech before the nine, Dev, I've heard you you spit that before. So that's one of your like pocket lines. Maybe figure out different ways to kind of tie it in together because it's like a signature of yours. So now try to like kind of play with it a little bit would be advice that I would give because I think you can kind of utilize that as almost a catchphrase. Um, you just got to figure out how to play with it a little bit. Um, uh, the never worried about being signed, that shit hit heavy. Um, and this is where I went into realizing all the stuff that I was enjoying about this round from Devolino. He was kind of talking about himself. Uh, I, once again, he wasn't really talking to entity. Um, Devolino spit some shit that I connected with in this round. But again, it wasn't really battle oriented to me. The only thing he say, said about Dave, uh, about Entity was at the end where he had the David Spade scheme, which I liked, by the way. Uh, but Entity, the, the Tommy Boy opener, Jesus fucking Christ, that had me laughing. Uh, the trans Karen, again, had me fucking laughing. The Wolverine full machine, that whole scheme was crazy. Um, and honestly, at that point, I just wanted to absorb the rest of the round. So I stopped taking notes. Um, because I thought that it was like and the way he was cooking, unless he choked in the middle of that round, a quarter of the way into that round, he had round three um, and just 
basically because he was more direct and his content was really good. Um, if Dev was more direct, it might be a closer battle, but uh, he just wasn't direct enough for me. And that's what I got to say on it. I loved, I, I loved what Devolino spit, his flow and delivery is getting really good. Uh, Entity was just a little bit too much for him tonight. That's all. All right, um, Benny. Benny Bizzle. I'm just eating a bag of crisps. <laughs> right. Um, yeah, I felt uh, it was a gentleman's free out for me. But not 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 uh not by a lot though. Every round was pretty close. They was both doing their thing. I liked um pretty much a lot of what uh what RD said so I thought was pretty spot on. I thought that the fact that Devolino weren't as personal as he usually is that hurt him. But I was impressed with Devolino. Like he made it a good fight. I felt like both guys sort of felt the pressure of the other guy as well in that first round. Like Devolino started out slower than he normally does. Uh, quite a lot so, even for a while. It took him a while to get to really get spazzing like he like he normally does. I think that was a thing because of the respect or whatever. I, I, I'm not too sure. I don't know. If he could, he could maybe comment on that at the end. But, um, yeah, I think like uh, when the say the first round when Devolino was paying his compliments and then and then I thought it when he was saying it. I thought, well, didn't you just win a battle like this? And then he he, he rebuttaled that shit and then said about it because I, I missed the Titan battle, but that's what I heard that he he gave him too many compliments. It was like a compliments battle, and he and he lost the battle over it. And then he sort of used that. That was fire. Um, yeah, but Dev did get some rebuttals and stuff in there. He was doing his thing. He he he, he was definitely saying some shit. They both was. The multis, the way that these guys was actually rhyming freestyle off the top for a whole minute, they're both very high-level freestylers when it comes to being able to rhyme and rap all day with the multis. Uh, I, I, I was impressed by both, but yeah, for me, a gentleman's free oh from NT. But uh, Dev, Dev, Dev didn't slouch on this one. It weren't like Dev was bad at all. Shut the fuck up. I had to mute him a hundred times. Don't shut the fuck up. Sorry. Um, okay. So we need to hear, we still need to hear from Ty. Yeah, I had it pretty much the same way. It was a, a 3 0. Uh, Dev had it sort of the same way Titan did with the with the compliment thing, which I didn't understand. And then I noticed the the bars about himself a lot, and but also he kept repeating himself about like because tonight, because tonight, like each yeah. round. So you know what I mean? It was kind of like it gets repetitive each round after a while. So if Dev could figure out a way to stop using the same comfortable lines that he's used to and start to implement more bars instead of just yeah. normal it's to go into the next bar, I think that that will set him up for a lot more success further in these gauntlets. But I also got entity with the Clear but close, three zero. That's some good advice right there. I I agree totally with that, Ty. Um, all right, you. so um, yeah, and I did talk to Bland about this scenario. He doesn't agree that somebody should get a buyout. They should. We should be doing it this way, where either the guys, the guys who are left, will battle each other for the redemption spot, um, or in this case, since Marco is the only one left. It's going to be Marco against Ritz again because he's the one here, and we they, Ritz can't just have a buyout to one of you guys. He can't. Ha he's he's got to have a, a battle before you guys go to Zod. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, RD, let's get it in. Hey, uh, uh, real quick though, um, just uh, just out of respect for Ritz, like um, I guess it's how Ritz feel about. I mean, going against me again. I mean, like uh, I thought. I got, uh, sorry, I, I got kind of confused. I thought it was going to be like a, a loser pool. Uh, yeah, no, but then, but it, I ourselves. thought now it should be Devolino versus Marco Polo and then the That's, winner of the yes. battle goes against Rich. Yeah. Marco, yeah. Dev to battle Rich. That that's makes sense. Oh, I and love that. Yeah, that's what, that's what makes sense. Yeah. yeah that's perfect. Then, I love yeah, that. Yeah, versus that, that, that's awesome. That's they awesome. both get a redemption. <laughs> love it. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, where, where, where's Ritz trying to pull me into a fucking battle here? What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, man. 
Listen, Love it. Okay, so that, that, that was, was the whole system. Don't do that tonight. That was yeah, a sick, was, sick, oh. sick battle. I'm gonna start another Zoom, and we will have a redemption battle between Marco <laughs> Polo <laughs> and Devolino. No, his name's the greatest. <laughs> oh, you fucking big chin, motherfucker. Look at him, like fucking Buzz Lightyear with his chin. <laughs> but, but look at XP. He's got testes stuffed in his cheeks right now. Okay, guys, I'm gonna start another Zoom. Can I get it? It's bars, bitch. Bars. It's bars. 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 Bitch. Bitch.